Hey guys, so I just wanted to show a little quick update here. I um, actually finally I drilled out this hole, and then this one here it goes through the stock hole. So I actually had to I drilled out a little bit of it with a small drill bit, and then I dremeled the rest of it out. This side here is not hard mounted. I might be able to I don't know maybe be able to stick a zip tie in there to make it more stout, but how it is right now. I think it would be good with two bolts, it's pretty in there, except for, um, don't be like me, these bolts literally have about a thread in there, anyways, yeah, I need to buy new longer bolts. I'm removing the t rear tire because the valve stem here, very angled, and I believe this is the cause for my flat tires for the rear. You can see it looks like there's a gap on the side here, the bottom side, and on top it looks like it's it might be cut or something, but when I try to fill air, air comes out from here, I think, and probably from the side here. What I did was I followed the Razor YouTube video where you use two flathead screwdrivers, and for the first one you just dig it under the tire, just do the side here between the, the wheel and the tire. And you pry it over and what I did was I wedged the handle under kind of like this holding it imagine the tires over the screwdriver and then I used the other one to go on the side of it pull it out do it on the other side pull it out and then evenly go all the way across right now I can't push the tire stem through it's pretty stuck on there on the wheel so I'm hoping that by the time I get the tire off and the inner tube, I can adjust the inner tube or take it out and re put it in. I'm going to test the inner tube with air first before I put it in to make sure it's not actually leaking. I think it has a hole in the inner tube, but yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. And after this, it should be good and rideable again. Looks like I found the culprit to my problems in the form of a tear right on the tire stem right here. Dang. I'm gonna try to tape it up and see if it works. So I failed to patch it up, but I went out to buy a new inner tube and nice and solid now. I'm gonna put it back on and take it for a test ride.